Hey guys, so today's video is on my makeup collection. Here's just kind of an overview of what I have going on. And I guess we'll just get right into it. We're going to start over here in this general area. I'm going to show you what's in those drawers. That's the majority of my makeup. Now I'll show you what's on the tops and then in those drawers and that drawer. And yeah, so let's get so it. So this is the top of that shelf um, or drawer set. And right here I just have, sorry this is kind of a little crazy, but... Right here I just have a gold chain that I really, really like, but it looks very kind of funny on me. And then this is just like a vase, and I filled it with some blue, like, um, little rocks. And then I have some EOS bombs. And then these are the brushes I don't typically use on an everyday basis, so just some fan brushes and things like that. And then I just have some sunglasses. And then right here, these four brushes I use. These four brushes I use on a daily basis, and they're just kind of in this little container. These are all like kabuki brushes, and they're all from RC Cosmetics. So this is what they look like. Love those. These brushes are in this little container type thing, and um, I use some of these every day. Like this one I use for highlight every day, and this one sometimes I use for contour, but these are just some brushes I don't reach for all the time. And then right here is when I need to clean like a brush right now. I'll just set it right there and there. And then right here I just have some bracelets, and then I have my beauty blender right here, which needs to be washed. And then I just have this little gem crystal necklace thing and I actually lost the um, chain to it so we're just kind of just kind of leave it there so the first drawer as you can see is kind of a mess and we just have um, we have some of this uh, rapid clear from Neutrogena we have some like little teeth tools those are my husband's um, the, this is not dirt, it's sand that came out of a sand dollar when I did a tutorial. This is just an eyelash curler, some tape, um, some nail stickers, a sample, wet ones. These are eye drops. Um, I use these every single night because I have irritated eyes. My tweezers. These are my favorite pair of tweezers right here. They really get all the hair off. Um, and some scissors and things like that and just some hair ties and like little brushes. It's just kind of like a random drawer. This brush, this brush, this drawer right here has, over here is all my powders. So I have, let me try to get a better angle. So I have um, this CoverGirl powder. I have some Stay Matte powders. I have some MAC powders. And then I have this Fit Me um, powder which I just kind of lay on top because right now it's my favorite and it's the one I reach for all the time. And then I have this um, L'Oreal Miracle Blur. I have my MAC Prep and Prime. What is that? Oh, my Prep and Prime um, uh, primer. <laughs> and then I have my, just a sample of like the Smashbox one. And then right here in the middle, I have a regular... Um, foundation. It's in the color light from Bare Minerals. This is a mineral veil and then I have Well Rested and then I have this that I've been kind of trying out. It's the True Blend from CoverGirl. It's just kind of like a powder. That is a concealer I got in my Ipsy bag which did not work at all. This little section is, this is my paint pot in Painterly from MAC and then these are literally all concealers. I know, it's a problem. It's literally a problem. Oh, and then I have a little sample of the What's Up from, what's it called, Benefit. And then I have um, a eyelid primer, but the rest is all concealer. This drawer is probably my favorite overall drawer that I have. Over here is all of my blushes. So I have an e.l.f. blush, which is really, really pretty. It's like a bright pink color. I have a L'Oreal two-toned blush and bronzer. I have a NYX mosaic blush. I have three Milani blushes, which are my absolute favorite, Luminoso, Fantastico Mauve, and Berry Amore. 
And then I have two MAC blushes. That's Pink Swoon. And that's Warm Soul. Yeah, Warm Soul. And then I have three Wet n Wild blushes. And then I have this Pixie bronzer, which I got in my Ipsy bag. <coughs> and then this is just like a box or whatever. And then just like a few little randoms. And that's just something random. And then this is bronzer, bronzer, uh, cream highlighter, highlighter, highlighter um, from Physicians Formula, hard candy. This is probably one of my favorite products right now. And then I have NYC bronzer and my MAC Soft and Gentle. This is probably my most opened drawer. But then I have this drawer, and as you can see, it's quite crazy. I guess I'll start over here. These are all of my color tattoos all the way back to right here. So these are all color tattoos. They're all in different colors. Let's see. I'll just give you like a few colors. This one is painted purple. So it's just a purpley color. And then we have like blues. And I think I have pretty much every color you could possibly need. There's a white, I have, um, this is pomegranate punk, that's probably my most used. And then back here are just some pigments. This one's from Bare Minerals, this one's from, um, Maybelline. And then I have a MAC eyeshadow in yogurt, is that what that says? Yeah. So then I have a MAC eyeshadow in yogurt, another Maybelline, um, pigment. This is another MAC eyeshadow in mulch. And then I have just some more like loose eyeshadows from Bare Minerals and Bare Minerals, Bare Minerals. <laughs> and this is just an eyeshadow from CoverGirl. And then here's another pigment from um, Maybelline. And then this is my favorite um, pigment from Makeup Geek. Sorry about that right there. That's a burn. I burnt myself like a week ago and it's still absolutely insane. This is Afterglow. It's so pretty. If I had a sifter, I'd literally open it and show you. Um, my Makeup Geek. And then this is just like a individual, individual eyeshadow. So this drawer is pretty much just like individual eyeshadows. And then I have like duos. This one's so pretty. It's from Hard Candy. You see how pretty that is? Like, oh, so pretty. It's from Hard Candy, um, as is this one, which is so pretty too. I have a NYX single in purple. Um, and then I just have some rant. This is literally just like random eyeshadow drawer. And then these are all NYX. So then I have a pink one. And this one kind of, the, the top of it broke, but it's like a blackish green color really pretty and then this came in an ipsy bag also it's just like a um little sample from bh cosmetics and then what are these oh these are elf eyeshadows which actually i don't really like that much at all um and yeah what's this oh these are just some more wet n wild shadows which i actually do like those ones a lot and then into my third divider, they're just some more randoms, um, just literally just random colors. This is black, I think, yeah, and then, um, these are just some quads, and this is my favorite highlight shade, um, it's Champagne. This is one of my absolute favorites, but if you're just gonna get, like, a single eyeshadow, this is so, so pretty. Like, look at that. It's so pretty. Okay. Um, and then I just have, I think these are all Wet n Wild Trio. Just, oh no, this is a Maybelline Quad. The only one I have. Um, but I absolutely love it. It's in Taupe Temptress. Love it. And then I have um, an NYC. <sighs> so this drawer is pretty much all of my mascaras and eyeliners right there. That's a brow powder. This is also a mascara. I got it in my Ipsy bag also. It's by M Cosmetics. Um, honestly, I really like the way it lengthens, but the stuff gets in my eyes and it causes a problem all day. So that's why it's in the back because it just causes me problems. 
And then here is just a glitter, which is really gross on the bottom. Brow powder, sharpener, and then this is just all, this is a lash glue. And then this is just all of my eyeliners and things like that. This is my Anastasia Brow Wiz, which actually needs to be out because I reach for that all the time. And then these are just like glitters and little samples and stuff like that. So that is that. So this drawer is a little bit uh, crazy as well. So I'm going to start back here. These are um, backups of my... Um, what is this called? My Revlon glosses. I got them on sale for $2 because they were going out. I got my two favorite colors, Peach Petal and then this color. I'm not even sure what it is, but it's like lilac or something. I love this color, so I had to get a backup of that. And then I just have, the, I got these on sale for a dollar. I got three of them. They are just the infallible eyeshadows. I haven't even touched them, though, not going to lie. Um, and then I just have like a soft lips, lip liners, um, random lip glosses, and stuff like that right here. And I have this right here. This is an Urban Decay sample of a revolutionary lipstick, which it's okay. I'm just not too fond of the color, but the formula is great. This is literally just a bunch of lip glosses and... Um, yeah, there's not too much to say about this drawer. It's pretty self-explanatory. Um, it's just a bunch, a bunch of lip gloss, lip glosses. This is my only MAC one, I think. It's a lip glass in Dreamy. And then right here is all of my lipsticks and my, um, like, jumbo pencils and things like that. So it's just a bunch of nudes, I have some vivids and things like that nature. This is probably one of my favorite sangria. If you know me, you know that's one of my favorites. So yep, this drawer is just lipstick and lip gloss, but it dries powder. So um, I never even had to set this with a powder. I've had this, actually this one forever and ever. So that just goes back there. And then I have some lashes and I actually have more that I just got but I haven't been able to put those in here yet and then I have the new me thing and this glitter palette that you're not supposed to use on your eyes so what am I supposed to use it for um, and then this is the worst thing I probably have ever bought in my life it's a hard candy like I thought it was gonna be this color but it's not it's just ridiculous and then I have some brushes that broke on me but I really like this one for contour and this one for powder so sometimes I use them a hair tie and then some like lip brushes and then this is my um, makeup remover for like spot treatment and that one's empty this bottom drawer is literally just all like hair stuff um yeah so nothing too crazy in there 